So guys, in this video, I will show you that how easily we can save any animation in Blender and also loop that animation over and over for a specific amount of time. So let's do it. Shift plus A, mesh. Let's add a cube. Bring our timeline up. Go to first frame. Press on I. Let's insert keyframe for the location. Let's change the position of the cube for like 5 meter in Z axis. Insert another keyframe. Let's move to frame 40. Change it back to 0. Final keyframe. So this is our animation for now. So how to save this animation? Go to animation tab. Click on this button. Then select non-linear animation. Give it some room. Now as you can see our cube name is cube.001. This is our cube, cube.001. And the orange one is our animation, this one. To save this animation, click on this button. Now the animation is saved. As you can see, we don't have any keyframes here, but we still have our animation because the animation is saved up there. Now suppose we want to run this animation after frame 60. So how? Just single left click, hold, move. Now the animation will start from frame 60. If you don't want to use this animation, just uncheck this. Now we don't have any animation here. Now the main thing how to loop. As you can see when we select our action or go to NLA, at the right side we have several options. Under action clip, we have repeat. Suppose we want to repeat this animation for two times. Just change it to two. Now suppose we want to increase the speed of the animation. For that, let's change the value from 1 to 0 0.5. Now if we check, the speed will be double. Let's see. Check it to enable the animation. See, it repeated two times. Let's change it to 3. So guys, that's how easily we can loop an animation in Blender. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day.